بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على عبده ورسوله نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين The Prophet صلى الله عليه وآله وسلم said O oh people seek Allah's forgiveness and repent to him for I seek Allah's forgiveness and repent to him more than a hundred times a day Ibn Umar, may Allah be pleased with him and with his father, said, We used to count the Prophet ﷺ repeating, seeking Allah's forgiveness in one setting more than 70 times. Now, if the Prophet ﷺ's previous and upcoming sins were already forgiven, why does he do this? First of all, to show his gratitude to Allah. Second of all, for us to follow suit. Asking Allah for forgiveness is one of the great deeds that opens closed doors beyond our wildest imagination. Allah Azza wa Jal tells us in Surah Nuh that Prophet Nuh Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is addressing his people by saying, فَقُلْتُ اسْتَغْفِرُوا رَبَّكُمْ إِنَّهُ كَانَ غَفَّارًا And I said to them, seek Allah's forgiveness because Allah is most forgiving. So one of Allah's beautiful names, that he is غفار, that he is غفور, that he is غافر. Allah forgives the sins. But the beautiful thing is, that when you seek Allah's forgiveness, listen what happens afterwards. Prophet Nuh said, peace be upon him, يُرْسِلِ السَّمَاءَ عَلَيْكُمْ مِدْرَارَ Allah would send rain over you where the earth would grow its crops and life would be everywhere around you. يُرْسِلِ السَّمَاءَ عَلَيْكُمْ مِدْرَارَ وَيُمْدِدْكُمْ بِأَمْوَالٍ وَبَنِينَ Allah Azza wa Jal would grant you wealth, would grant you offspring, would grant you gardens without end and rivers overflowing. And all of this as a result of seeking Allah's forgiveness. We're not talking about what Allah has prepared for those who seek His forgiveness in the hereafter. This goes beyond our imagination. We're talking about worldly matters. When a servant of Allah expresses his submissiveness, his need, his humility to Allah and asks for forgiveness, this means that he acknowledges that Allah forgives the sins. Allah the Almighty says in the Hadith Al-Qudsi, when the Prophet tells us, when a servant of Allah sins and says, Oh Allah, I have sinned, and no one forgives the sins except you, Oh Allah, forgive me. Allah Azza wa says, My servant had sinned, and he acknowledged that I only forgive the sins, and he's seeking my forgiveness, I forgive him. Allah Azza wa Jal descends to the lowest heaven every single night and He addresses His servants. Is there anyone seeking my forgiveness so that I would forgive him? Allah encourages us to seek His forgiveness and therefore each and every Muslim must keep this as a daily reminder that he always asks Allah for forgiveness and that he always repents to Allah, the Almighty. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.